Hey everybody, thanks for joining me today as we enjoy this amazing hobby together and I will be opening up some 2020 Tops Baseball Update. Um, if you're new to the channel, I just wanted to let you know that I um, I like to rip my product up slowly. You know, you're pretty much watching a vlog of me opening up every single um, pack and box that I buy. And so I like to take my time because this hobby is expensive and because retail product is hard to find at retail prices, right? So I honestly feel blessed to be opening up anything. So let's get ripping here, all right? If you don't have time to, um, to watch me rip everything, then feel free to skip to the end of the video where um, I recap all my, my hits. All right, so today we are going to be ripping up a 2020 Tops baseball update packs. We're opening up um, one, two, three, four, five, six packs. Um, these six packs were actually available at my local Target, and so I, I was like, okay, wow, this is really cool. Like I've never seen, you know, it's 2021 now, and they have 2020 update um, baseball available, and I've never opened up this product on this channel 2020 update so i'm excited to do, to do that um each pack comes with 16 cards and so what 16 times 6 let me see 6 plus 24 84 cards right i think my math is right i'm not too sure but but yeah um if you're interested here are um dude, that's super hard to read but if you're interested here are your odds feel free to pause that if you want let me move my mic here real quick. All right, and so yeah, let's get ripping here. Um, so let me set this up first. Move those there. Put that there. Bring out these bad boys. There, yeah. Now you can see everything. You see the pack still. We'll put one more stand out there too. But now it's uneven. You gotta, you gotta make it even. You gotta make it look nice-ish. Nice, nice-ish. That's the goal. All right, here we go. All right. Just have to pull my sleeves back a little bit. All right, so here's the first pack. Um, I am not too sure what the hits were for... Um, 2020 update. I don't know like who they finally printed off Printed in 2020 update um, That was before I got into the hobby, but yeah, our first card here is of a Nick Solak very nice rookie debut in August Not too bad Put him in my rookie pile here And then we got Tyler White I don't think he's with the Dodgers anymore. Right? I don't think he is. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's amazing how much can change in one year. We got Yachty here. For the cards, we got eliminated. Kentamaeda for the PC. Todd Frazier, that looks like a home run derby card. Hey, dude, that is nice. Oh my gosh. What? What? Frank Schwindel. He is now with the Chicago Cubs. And he's a 29 year old rookie. I think he still, yeah, he still qualifies for a rookie at bats and everything. So, um, Former all-star selection from single, double, and triple-A levels. Yeah, I guess he just didn't pan out um, for the Tigers. Plus, the Tigers are, like, totally loaded, too. So, um, that's awesome. This is a sweet card. I might top-load this just because I'm a Cubs fan. And Schwindel is... One of the bright spots of the future for the Cubs. I mean, Schwindel, 
Who else we got? Patrick Wisdom, who's also like a 29-year-old rookie. Um, we got Nick Madrigal, who should do really well next year. Nico Horner, if he can stay healthy. And, and a bunch of other young guys. But we'll move on. We got Brian Johnson. Eric Thames. Mitch Moreland. Decades best. Man, I still got to watch that 30 for 30 about the Mets. That's, that seems real interesting. And we've got a McCutcheon like, insert here. That's pretty cool looking. Followed by Glaber over there. This is really cool. Prominent baseball players. The athletic baseball and the athlete picture department. That's interesting. Prominent baseball players. That's kind of cool. We got Gliber Torres here. From Glaber. We got another all-star game of Mookie Betts. Nestor Cortez. Was Nestor... I forget. See the guy that got traded? Don't remember. Don't remember. Uh, let me see. I gotta start another pile here but yeah if you, if you don't know um frank schwindel he actually run one rookie of the month for september which is nice that meant the, um so that means that the cubs actually um they got rookie of the year in september and i think they got a rookie of the year in like june as well we got verlander and adeni hachavaria here. How long has how long has Danny been playing? I was gonna say he seems like a I feel like I've heard his name a lot. So he's kind of been all over the place. Good for him, good long career for him. Oop, let me get that cloth out of the way. Um but yeah, and then uh, Patrick Wisdom got like rookie of the month back in I forget. June ish before the all star break. Because after the all star break you started to struggle a little bit. But that's okay. I mean, Schwindel came out of nowhere. Oh, that is nice. Jordan Alvarez Gold Cup rookie card. Dude, that is sweet. I like Jordan. Um, I, I like Jordan. I respect him. I don't consider him as part of the cheaters. But, I mean, the White Sox did accuse them of, I don't know, doing some shady stuff during their um, playoff games against each other. Altuve, Jose Altuve. I wonder what's gonna happen to Altuve. Uh, I, I as a Cubs fan, would not mind having Altuve on my team. So we'll see what happens there. Alex Avila, Aaron Judge, home run derby. We got Cano here, Robinson Cano, and we got Kurt Casale. Cody Stashak rookie card. He's a twin, so I'll put him in my PC pot here. We got Brandon Dixon. Ooh, and look at that. That's a Topps Chrome. Anthony Rendon. That is nice. Dude, that is really nice. Dude, that's cool. I will leave that up. Hopefully he comes back and does really well next year. I mean, shoot. I mean, the. I mean, if Mike Trout can stay healthy and Anthony Rendon can stay healthy, um, dude, I think the Angels would have won maybe like 10, 10 more games this year. Just my opinion. But yeah. Tuve. Ooh, look at that cool Gavin Lux card here. Oh man, yeah, tonight's game's gonna be good. So I'm recording this on uh, Thursday. So then, uh, it's game five for the Dodgers and the Giants. So that should be an awesome game. We got Pete Alonso here for the All Star game, followed by Kendall Graveman. Is Kendall Graveman the guy that got traded? I don't remember. I gotta research that. KB. 
for the Cubs. We got a Jake Newberry, followed by Jeff Hoffman. All right, that's pack number two. We move on to pack number three. That, that pack is pretty decent. I mean, I'll take that Jordan with the rookie logo and the gold cup and Gavin Lux as well. That's not bad at all. And that Rendon. All right, Zach Davies, Albert Pujols, Adam Plutko, Logan Forsyth, Thomas Nito, Tommy Pham. Miguel Cabrera, and we got a Jerry Rodriguez rainbow foil here. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. Send that off to Com C. Maybe get a buck for it or something. It's not numbered, but is this a rookie card? I didn't say it was a rookie card. Yeah, I don't think it's a rookie card. Ooh, look at that. We got a throwback card here of Kiebert Ruiz. This should be a rookie card too, right? I feel like it should be. Kiebert Ruiz, he's now with the um, Washington Nationals there. Mr. Ronald Acuna there. Ooh, look at that. That's a sweet looking Boba Shet. That looks pretty centered. Hold up, hold up. Dude, that looks pretty nice. These cards are hard to grade. Cause that gray border edges are gonna kill you on this card. But sweet, man, I got a Boba Shet card here. This might be my first Boba Shet rookie card here. So I'll move Anthony Rendon down. All right. Sweet, man. These packs are pretty nice so far. Matt Davidson. Jairo Diaz. This is a all-star card game. Torres and Mookie there celebrating. Ooh, and we got uh, Tuki Toussaint for the Braves. And we got a battery bath. Martin receives a cold bath. From Bueller. It's nice. That looks cool. Russell Martin Walker Bueller there. All right. We are halfway through. We're opening up pack number four of six. Yeah, 2020 baseball. 2020 update has been pretty good for me. So, uh, 2021 update should be coming out at the end of the month. So, uh, the checklist already came out. And I think the hobby stuff comes out at the end of the month. So I should be hitting your Walmarts and Targets uh, maybe in about a um, month plus two weeks. Okay, Jonathan Davis. Yasmani Tomas. Brad Miller. I like those socks. Those are pretty cool. Rock and Phillies card. Segura and Bryce Harper here. Then we got Ty Buttery. And we got Greg Holland. I like Greg Holland. Solid guy. Yep. <clears throat> Ooh, Mariano Rivera. That's sweet. Omar Nar uh, Narvez. Followed by Giancarlo Stanton. Ooh, wow, look at that. Decades best. Mark McGuire. That's pretty cool. Brinson. Brinson. What's his last name? Carl Lewis Brinson. That's pretty nice. Gliber Torres. Or is it Glaber? Right? I don't know. I think it might be Glaber. Wookie Betts All Star Game. Nestor Cortez rookie card. And Adini Hachaviara. And Justin Verlander. Whoa, that was the same run there. See, Adeni Hachavaria. Hachavaria. Oh, cool. All right. Pack was decent. That was the worst pack so far. Um, 
Let's see here. Who's this? Kyle Ryan. Never heard of him. Okay, okay. But he is a Cub, so throw him to my Cubs PC. Josh Taylor, rookie card. Followed by Robert Stevenson. Ooh, okay, we got Sean Popin for the Twins, rookie card. Michael Fulmer. And then we got Mr. Dievi Grulin. Right there, put him in the rookie pot. Oh, Alec Mills. Yep, I'll put him in mine. In my Cubs pot. Oops, sorry there. Got a bunch of packs, open packs on the side there. Ian Miller, rookie card. I don't, and I do not know who he is. And I'm a Cubs fan. All right. Ryan Weber, decades best. I don't know if I would call them the decades best in the 2000s. I mean, yeah, they did win the World Series and their team was really balanced, but Wade Boggs, that's sweet. That insert there, that's nice. Clyber Torres again, Mookie Betts All-Star Game, Nestor Cortez, that's my third one, holy cow. Uh, and uh, Justin Verlander at the end there again. Whoa, are you guys seeing this? Like three packs have had those two same cards at the end. The Denny and the Justin Verlander. All right. Let's see if that can happen again. Is that fourth pack. You're going to find a fourth pack with a Denny and a Justin Verlander in the back there? I don't know. We'll see. Chris Iannetta. Miles Straw. Yeah, Nico Horner rookie card. Sweet. Man, if Nico can just stay healthy, that would be amazing. Um, I know he got a hit an oblique injury this year, so oblique injuries are kind of tough because um, you know it's it's part of your core, and it's just I think you're ready, but you never really know. Rowdy Telez, Chris Martin, Hunter Renfro, Jared Wash. Hey, Dalton Varsho here, number one prospect card. That's pretty cool. Another Acuna insert. Nice. Ooh, Hunter Pence. What, what what are these called? Oh, yeah, the prominent baseball players one. That's nice. Todd Frazier, all-star game. And then, who do we got here? Adolis Garcia, very nice. Logan Morrison, wait, wait, Adolis Garcia. Okay, I don't, this is probably a first year card, but it's not a rookie card. Probably had it in like series one or something, or series two. So that's it, inaugural season. Logan Morrison, oh, nope, we got different cards. Kyle Gibson and Robinson Chirinos. But we got lots of Texan, Texan, Texan. Another Texan. Followed by another Texan. Yeah, that was weird. Four Texans out of five to close up this pack. So they do a Trinos. Right? Nope, I'm wrong. Trinos has been in the league for a while. So, all right. Hey, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. This Don Varsh was kind of cool. I like the design of that. Um, yeah. But we, we got a whole bunch of Nestor Cortez. Yeah, I'll do a re recap now. We got Yevi Gulian, Grulin, Josh Taylor. We got three Nestor Cortez cards. And Nick Slowlack. Slowlack should be pretty good. Um. We also got some rookies over here. Here, let's see. We got Nico Horner. Like I said, hopefully he can just stay healthy. Mm, I don't think we have any more rookies here. Popin or Poppin. Skeever Ruiz card. Um, yeah, but for sure our best cards are these right here. 
which which isn't too bad. The Lux and the Bichette, I'm excited for those. Um, I love Jordan. I think he's probably the best hitter. Yeah, he's definitely the best hitter on the Astros right now, and that's that's saying a lot because they've got a lot of good hitters there. Um, and we got this Frank Schwindel rookie card from. So I mean, it's pretty good pack. Those six packs, you know, produce some pretty good um, hits here. So. Um, 2021 tops update. I give this set overall. I guess I would give this set. I don't know it's hard to compare it, but um, I don't. Know, I'll give it a C. I guess um, it's not horrible. It's not amazing, but it's still fun to rip. Um, these packs. I would give these packs probably like a C plus because I mean I'm just happy that I finally have a Boba Shet rookie card. And I've got like a legit Jordan Alvarez rookie card. I mean, that's his rookie debut card, but that's okay. And like Schwindel, man, as a Cubs fan, man, you're you're hoping for Schwindel to just keep doing well. He's such a goofy guy too, so he's really likable. Um, so yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching me enjoy this hobby. I greatly appreciate it because I know your time and attention is valuable. So if you could. Please give this video a like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so that you'll know when I upload more videos. And remember, this hobby is amazing, and so are you. I hope you're able to secure some retail product at retail prices and that you have some amazing polls as well. So you take care of yourself, and I'll see you in the next video.